What's up, guys? Welcome back to this week's episodes of Persona 5 Strikers. Yes, it's continued right after. Doing this all in one setting. Mm -hmm. Getting some stuff out of the way. Does she even notice us talking right now? This overwhelming onslaught of pointless info. We got ourselves a nerd, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, sorry about, you know, the bag thing. Huh? What? Oh, you mean the cat? Don't worry, I won't tell the staff or anything. By the way, are you all students? Hmm, I could see a couple of you being in college, but not you. You've still got an air of innocence about you. In which case, you'll be taking your entrance exam soon, right? Have you decided where you're going to apply yet? Oh, forgive me. I haven't even introduced myself. I'm Kuani Chinose. I work as a researcher over at Toho University. Hey, you guys should come check out the campus. It's way up in the mountains, but it's a lot of fun. Lots of bears this season, too. The bears? Oh, uh, you know, we kind of got something going on already, so we don't exactly got the time. I see, I see. Yes, well, it's important that you do what you want while you're still young. Allow me to impart a little treat till next we meet. Andy! Uh, sure? Well then, I've had my fill of beef tongue, so it's probably best if I get going. Farewell, young ones! Well, she's an interesting character. She's probably gonna be a plot So, point. uh, she was weirdly energetic, huh? Well, thankfully, we avoided getting in trouble. We should be grateful she didn't tell on us. Sorry, that was my fault. Ah, uh, I got carried away too. Sorry, Mona-chan. We'll buy you some sasa kamaboko later. You mean the fish cake on the skewers with that nice layer of jar on top? Oh, I can't wait! His latest work was just perfect. I was able to make it two nights in a row, if you can believe that. Speaking of which, I read in a magazine that he's going to be at the station today. There's no way I'm missing that. All right, let's finish eating. And I have a feeling it has something to do with the magazine or the, the comic book or something like that. Keep going with amazing. Get those bond points. I'm stuffed. How you can eat five bowls of rice is beyond me. Is your stomach a black hole or something? Look, if they're offering free refills, then you can bet I'm ordering them. Indeed. You can eat the first bowl and focus exclusively on the glistening of the meat. Then the aroma on the next, and so on. Pretty sure that's just you. Well, I will say the food here certainly is delicious. Yeah! <laughs> Good job, Sophia. It was, as they say, a piece, piece of cake. <laughs> Guess we should leave where we eat up to Sophia now, huh? Hmm? What's going on over there? <clears throat> Natsume-san! Your lady says she was just amazing as always! Natsume-san! Over here! Can you please sign my copy? <laughs> Thank you for all your support. Whoa, hold on now. Only one autograph per person, please. Yep. Oh. My apologies, but could the men please go to the back of the line? Ladies first, you see. Who the hell's that? He looks pretty popular. I heard that woman say latest book. Does that mean he's a writer? Oh, ho, ho. hello there. Are you looking for an autograph as well? Or perhaps a handshake? Huh? Um... Oh, how terribly rude of me to keep such lovely fans waiting. Please, accept this as a token of my apology, yes? Don't worry, I've already signed it. Um, okay. Listen, uh, we were just passing by. Ah, uh, is that so? It seems I got a little ahead of myself. Prince of Nightmares by Ango Natsume. Yours truly, Ango Natsume. It's a pleasure. Prince Royal Jackass! That's the name from those flyers on the Masamune statue. Why, flyers on Masamune statue? 
Ah, I think I know what happened. That's most likely the work of some of my more zealous fans. I appreciate them promoting my work, but it appears they went overboard somewhat. Honestly, they can be a real handful sometimes. Allow me to apologize on their behalf. In exchange, allow me to offer you a kiss. Yo, back off, dude. Can't you see you're making her uncomfortable? And who are you supposed to be? I believe I was addressing these lovely young ladies here. I thank you not to interrupt. Mm, sorry, but they're with us. Got a problem, you can always talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you yeah. seriously think you can get away with speaking to me like that? <laughs> My, this one's got some backbone, doesn't he? Mr. Natsume, we need to get moving soon. <laughs> Well then, it seems I must be going. Down. I've a magazine interview to get to. To all those who have read my book, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Oh, uh, I'm Natsume! going in. Natsume! I love you! Oh, he's just so dreamy. I'll have to buy ten more copies tomorrow to show him just how much I care. Who was that man? I don't know if he was some local big shot or whatever, but he sure was pissing me off. a strange one for sure but the people around him seemed really happy why was that probably because they're a bunch of weirdos i must agree it wasn't at all deserving of such praise even in the form of flattery are you all right haru mm -hmm. i was just a little surprised as all how did jerk like him get so popular Ugh, it doesn't make any sense hmm. monarch there might be something else going on here he could even be changing people's hearts. You mean, he's the monarch of the Sendai Jail? It's just one possibility. No, I, I think you might be onto something. If he's the monarch, then everything else totally makes sense. Perf, I got my laptop back at the RV. Should be able to dig something up from there. Yep, mm. I figured he's gonna be hanging on out today. I may not have any evidence of him being the monarch yet, but he sure is fishy. Let's get back to the camper. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. Ooh, we got some shots. Hey. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Can't go there yet. Yeah. I wonder if the pen of these come to Sunday. Oh, we're in Sunday. And we're gonna take somebody's pop. <laughs> He's hmm? still broken. They're still sold out. Let's go. Mona won't let me do anything. Let's go. Yeah, Mona won't let me do anything. All right, let's go over what we know so far. Sophia, you can confirm there's a jail here, correct? The smell got a lot stronger once we entered the city. So yes, I'm sure of it. And the man we met earlier, his name was Ango Natsume? I just did a quick search on him. Here's what came up. Ango Natsume, grandson to renowned writer Sogo Natsume. Currently a successful light novel author. Says the guy kicked off his career with his debut work, Prince of Nightmares, which won the grand prize in the Sokaisha Awards. This thing's selling stupidly well. It sold a million copies alone. A million? That's kind of nuts, right? A little bit. Yeah, for someone's debut to hit numbers like that is nothing short of a miracle. I checked social media, and, well, this whole thing is kind of bizarre. Natsume's fans are probably going on some kind of rampage, right? There's a rumor that some people got beat within an inch of their lives just because they were sort of dressed like Natsume's characters. Right. The worst part is that no one stepped in to stop them. In fact, the attackers were praised for what they did. These are likely the same kinds of people who defile Masamune's statue with flyers. They clearly lack self-restraint. The fans at the station seemed really passionate, too. 
It was almost like they were part of a cult. I'm checking some of the online forums. It looks like there's about a hundred threads created about this dude almost every day. And they're all positive. Not only that, but all of these IP addresses are from Sendai. That's crazy suspicious. This is definitely our guy then, right? That's true. We haven't determined his abilities as a writer yet. If he really is just some freakishly talented writer, then the jail here has nothing to do with him, and he earned all that praise, right? But there's still a chance he's our monarch too, ain't there? That's what we're gonna find out. Tomorrow, we'll go into town and see what intel we can dig up. If he's the monarch, then there's a good chance we'll run into some victims who've had their hearts changed, just like in Shibuya. Oh yeah, we should probably let Inspector Gramps know too, huh? Good idea. He might be able to give us some other clues too. Okay, well, I guess we should all probably hit the hay. We've got a busy day tomorrow. So... Why the hell are we sleeping up top? Might as well be sleeping outside. Ain't it gonna be cramped? There's nothing we can do. There isn't enough room in the car. Besides, it's not as bad as you say. Back when there were more students at the Atelier, it was quite normal for us to sleep huddled together due to lack of space. Man, you always keep cool in the weirdest possible way. You know that? Come on, guys, <laughs> are we really just gonna call it a night? Shouldn't we, like, all be playing cards till super late or stargazing or something? Ain't that the kind of shit we're supposed to do on a big trip like this? Sure, whatever, but I mean, come on, dude, something ain't right here. Forget it, Ryu. We're up early tomorrow anyway, so you'd better get some rest. Man, it's gonna be hot as hell with three of us and Morgana, ain't it? Very true. That fur certainly won't help things either. Oh, what do you want from me? I can't help that I'm a cat. Not that I'm actually a cat, though. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There's no way I'm sleeping. <laughs> I fell asleep to all that story. Yeah, right. <clears throat> Eight one. I guess first! Awesome! And it's a decision. Let's score uh, some leads in the smug bag. Alright. Take it down a notch, dude. You're bouncier than the grade schooler on summer vacation. You're, uh, are you alright, Futaba? Are you, uh, are you not a morning person? I don't sleep much last night. I can't get company without my usual <sighs> Well, it was our first night sleeping in the RV, so I suppose it's no surprise. You'll get used to it over time, I'm sure. The station is really busy for a weekday, maybe because everyone's at school. Mm -hmm. The shopping arcade is the only short walk away. The home festival decorations are apparently a popular attraction for sightseers. Oh, I see. Sunday's Hanabata <laughs> Festival is coming up soon. Uh, seems like there's plenty of shops to draw crap. Perhaps we should try asking around over there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do the same thing what we did with Alice. Let's just meet up again once we've had some. Cool. Big in this investigation. Take a look. Uh, slightly reduces jail security level. Uh, increases showtime dodge. You picked Ooh. the good stuff. Here you up and shop with us again. That'll be a useful, like, oh shit, item. Hmm? Uh, the place that we got the, uh, oh, yeah. yeah. 
Beef Pound. We'll have to come back one day. Welcome. Take a gander. Cooking recipes from shops. Some cooking recipes can be sold in local shops. Don't miss the opportunity to buy them whenever you find them. Um, if you miss out on any recipes, it's still possible to buy them from somebody's own shop. However, be aware that obtaining them this way will be much more expensive. 1,600? 20,000. That is a big difference. Yeah, let's buy them. There you are. What a coincidence. Wait, are you planning on ordering goods and stew? Then allow me to join you. I hear that beef tongue when softened and stew is simply divine. I must confirm this myself. What in heaven? Superb, truly superb stitch. Feel flash of inspiration. Uh, Wutain. Oh, that's good. Find the Wutain just to have it. Is that all? And we'll buy resource 58. Here you are. Thanks again. Come again. By every last one, then maybe I go will finally notice me. If I don't hurry, I'll miss his book what signing. Natsume's doing a book signing. Search complete. Natsume will be holding a book signing nearby, and it's happening in really? Reese. Wait, is that why they're all here? Bookstore is in a mall named Portro, and the event starts in one hour. Let's see, alright, Stitch, let's come back when we are done with the room. Arcade Street's just over there. We can just walk there. We'll play dead ends. We'll just to double check to make sure there's no items. Hmm? Why? Why do this to me, my honey pie? We swore our love to each other over here. You told me you special words to you, so why? Why did I do wrong? Poor woman leaving his man because of a jackass. Here. Wow, this place is crowded. Crazy. Yo! <laughs> Aliens. Uh, they're apparently called streamers. In Sendai, they're known as being topped with a large ball called a Kusadama. Now that I think about it, it isn't Tanabata celebrated in July? It looks like Tanabata is observed using the old lunar calendar. So the festival is held a month later in August. Uh, I don't know if I follow you, but whatever. August rules. Oh, there's some right here. Oh, no, it's right here. Chocolate banana. What's up? I'm gonna buy a chocolate banana. Uh, maybe not. I want one, but 400 for 30 HP. Not. Stitch, I was wandering around the shopping area here. I've got sweets on the brain with all these desert shops and food stands around. The temperature is worse. Told it when I saw a place with Gu Time Gyotin ice cream. That was so cold. It also sells chocolate bananas. Alright, sorry about that. I should get back to asking you about that. <laughs> Restores fear, rage. Restores HP to one and ally. Come again. Oh, you want to know about Argonasa? <laughs> you and the rest of society, everyone's talking about him lately and it makes me sick. Pretentious pricks like that are always fighting someone. Her business has been good lately thanks to all of the Nazi's gift merch. People need to wake up. There are plenty of other good authors out there. Pineapple shop. 
Can I help you find something? Ooh. Is that all you need? It's all and it's beat. I will you again. Buy it. Give me, give me, give me. General store. Hmm. What is it that you see? Uh, 20 SP. A keychain with a popular character. Uh, get a patch in the book's feelings of unparalleled war for agility. That is a very, very tempting accessory. Until you return. Something is amiss. Look, Stitch, the general store over there is usually packed with female customers. Perhaps it's just my vision, but they're icing all of them. I don't think it's just your same thing. I think you're actually they are hollow. Now, what we got Welcome. here? Hack you push Yaki so 20 HP to all allies. Come again! Mm -hmm. uh, ooh! Yes, HP. around the shop to apparently send eyes in the middle of not some fever. It's even affecting some of the shop staff. I've heard some complaints it's getting bad business. People no call, no showing, or even ditching their ships part way through to go pick up more copies. Could it be? But their hearts have been changed. God, when I told one of the local restaurant owners that I was on the trip, his friends gave me this. It's a hamburger from the local chain using all the local ingredients. Very good. Good a Gaitan burger. Got one last shop. Right Local supermarket. We've got what you need, so that's what you're getting. Can you hold? We recommend. Thank you. We recommend. Thank you. So that's what you're getting. Thank you. So that's what you're getting. Thank you. So that's what you're getting. Can you hold? So that's what you're getting. Can you hold all that? And now I'm broke. I'll be waiting for you. Now that I know cooking is going to be an essential. Right here's mm -hmm. gonna be the last thing. Mm -hmm. This bookworm detailed her social media accounts. Isn't bookworm that Audrey really likes? She's been putting out quite a lot of. Maybe she got depressed. Her last post did mention how she's tried. She's tired of trying to make her voice heard in a vacuum. Though not so is the cause. Have you read Ango's book? The story and the dialogue is so similar to what bookworm would do. Hey, be careful. We're talking about Sago and Natsumi's grandson here. You'll get flamed if you talk about it seriously. Hey. Did you hear that? She seemed suspicious of Ongo and Natsume stealing other people's work. I wonder if it's true or just some rumors. 100% investigation complete! Alright! Plan of so now I say it's safe to sell it quits. Remember not out of recession we heard about. This is our chance to see him in person. Let's do some first party reconnaissance. That's indeed. Just to make sure, got a thing that I think of. Alright then. Shop, shop. Shop. Oh, to send dice dish on. Huh? Oh, yeah. I'm kind of broke. So. I'll just add this. Oops. Save on a new day.
got smug bastards being promoted all over the place. Like I'm going insane. That's quite a crowd for a book signing. Oh, there's so many people. I think I'm gonna throw up. Is he gonna give out his keyword for Emma and change everyone's hearts like Alice did? We should keep an eye on him for now. Um, Natsume-san? I just wanted to say thank you for putting out such wonderful work all the time. I was so touched by your book. I ended up buying 50 copies. Yeah, well, I bought a hundred. Some to read, some to collect, some to give out, and some to... My goodness! Thank you! I'm flattered. Reading hundred copies book of a book. Somehow gives me hope. Courage to keep going. I won't rest until each and every one of my friends knows about your book. Well, I have said that I want my book to reach as many people as possible. I can't help but feel guilty, though. Be sure you don't overdo it. No, it's okay. I'm helping you because I want to. I heard the reason he started writing novels was for this poor girl who's bedridden in the hospital. Supposedly, he wanted her to keep fighting so she could one day see him finish his novel. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. He's just so compassionate. It's like he's a saint. I know, no. that story alone's enough to make me cry. I guess even real life is like a novel sometimes. We yeah. have to tell the whole world about Ango Natsume's good deeds. Yeah. I'd expected as much, but he's really popular. Yeah, that is not real. Do you think that bit about the girl in the hospital is for real? Dude didn't seem like the type, if you ask me. I don't think Natsume said anything resembling a keyword. Could it be because he really isn't a monarch? Or perhaps he's just being careful. If he is the monarch, maybe everyone here's already had their hearts changed. Meaning he wouldn't need to give out his keyword. Hey, Inari, what's that you've been reading? Ango Natsume's novel, Prince of Nightmares. Inari? You actually bought that thing? I simply wanted to check whether the content of the book was truly deserving of the fervent praise it's received. Well, how is it? Is it good? Hmm. How should I put it? For any creative work, one should be able to feel some sense of its creator's passion. No matter how crude or unrefined the work may be, there should always be some sort of spark present to those engaging with it. I'm not terribly well versed in the literary arts, but... I feel nothing when reading this book. The sentences are formed well enough, but what's here is shockingly hollow. It's as if these words have been taken from someone else and given the most bare minimum coat of paint possible. Let me see. Oh, wow. This line here is lifted from an anime from two years ago. The words got changed a bit, but that's definitely it. Sneaky. I think I've seen this one before, too. And this one. Sheesh. This one, too. Wait, is this whole book just a bunch of stuff he ripped off and strung together? If the original writers, or worse, their fans, ever saw this, there'd be a frickin' riot online. I can't possibly fathom how such a fraudulent piece of work garnered this much praise. That is, unless the fans had their desires stolen. It's the power to change hearts. With all that we know now, it's safe to say there's definitely something going on here. Yep. If only we knew the keyword, we can investigate the jail for ourselves. Think we should ask some of his fans? They've all had their desires taken, right? If this is anything like the situation in Shibuya, I doubt they'll tell us anything. Guess we're kind of stuck then. Have we heard anything from Gramps yet? He said he'd be here by tonight. Maybe he learned something. All right then. I guess we should go ahead and wait for Inspector Hasegawa then. Hold on. What's up? Why do you think Natsume wrote this novel? Your fame. No. Somehow I don't believe that's the case. No matter how much praise your work receives, if it was built on the backs of others, then you cannot truly call that praise your own. Those compliments will surely ring empty. Anyone in the arts should know this. That is why I don't understand. 
What was he thinking when he wrote this novel? What are you two doing? Let's get going. Okay, so my main... apologies. It wasn't my intention to hold you up. Let's be off. So he's gonna be the next actor or next person. Like how Anne was the first one. And now it's going to be. <laughs> Pretty nice ride you've got here. And I gotta say, I didn't expect Sendai to be on the agenda. How'd you know there was a jail here? Well, about that. I smelled it. Hmm. You smelled it? Anyways, have you learned anything new? Ah, yes. Ango Natsume, right? Yeah, he's suspicious, all right. His book's been selling like crazy, but only here in Sendai. Most of the other stuff I've heard lines up with what you guys told me. Anyhow, I did some asking around, and here's what I found. Apparently, everyone in Atsume's little fan club becomes friends with him through Emma. And once that happens, they start buying his book any and every chance they get. Some even go into debt because of it. Any of this sound familiar? Yep. It's just like what happened with Alice. He might have different methods from Alice Hiragi, but I'm almost certain Natsume is using the same power. Well, in that case, we really need to get our hands on his keyword. Can't we just nab this shithead and make him cough it up? Ugh, do that? And I would have to arrest you for assault. You can ramble on about the jails all you want. Best case scenario is you getting dragged off to a mental institution. Ah, right. Yep. Well, we're phantom thieves, so going at it directly is not preferred anyway. Ah, oh, there goes Beauty Thief. Always trying to be elegant and subtle and stuff. <laughs> Alright, we're at 31 minutes, guys. We're gonna call this episode here. Stay tuned for the next one.